unchaining the meaning, dragging the chain, explained. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of English language and idioms. Today, we're going to unravel the meaning behind the intriguing phrase, dragging the chain. Whether you're learning English as a second language or simply love exploring idiomatic expressions, this video is for you. So, let's get started and find out what it really means to be dragging the chain in various contexts. Before we dive into our specific phrase, let's briefly talk about what idioms are. Idioms are phrases or expressions that cannot be understood from the meanings of their individual words. They have a figurative meaning that's different from the literal meaning. Understanding idioms is crucial for mastering a language because they enrich communication and give insight into cultural nuances. To fully appreciate the figurative meaning of dragging the chain, it's helpful to visualize the literal action. Imagine someone physically dragging a chain behind them. It's slow, laborious, and it hinders progress. This imagery is key to understanding the metaphorical use of the phrase. Now, let's explore the figurative meaning of dragging the chain. This phrase is commonly used to describe someone who is holding others back or slowing down progress in a group setting. It can be used in work environments, team projects, or even in social situations. If someone is said to be dragging the chain, they're not keeping up with the others, either due to lack of effort, skill, or enthusiasm. To give you a better understanding, here are a few examples of how dragging the chain can be used in sentences. We could have finished this project weeks ago, but Mark has been dragging the chain. The team is full of talented players, but their goalkeeper has been dragging the chain all season. We all agreed to pitch in for the party, but Lisa is dragging the chain and hasn't done her part. While dragging the chain is a vivid expression, it's important to use it appropriately. It can be perceived as negative or critical, so it's best used in contexts where constructive feedback is welcome or when describing a situation informally. Always consider your audience and the setting before using idiomatic expressions. And there you have it, a deep dive into the meaning of dragging the chain. We hope this exploration has not only enriched your English vocabulary but also sparked your interest in the colorful world of idioms. Remember, language is a window into culture, and idioms like these are the decorative curtains. Thank you for watching, and we hope to see you in our next video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating insights into the English language. Happy learning!